Well, the car park's a little bit full tonight, so I don't expect uh, to have the area to myself. The um, Friday night heading in to the Rohini's. Uh, forecasts are looking good for the next couple of days, so hopefully with uh, light breeze and no cloud, no rain. So yeah, it's getting on. It's about quarter to eight time I got over here. Um, so just about to throw the pack on and climb the hill. Um, hope to make the bush edge and camp just up there, just on dark. So we'll get moving. G'day. Oh, we, um, I've made it to the top of the ridge. I um, got to the first campsite and there's a young fella camp there so I thought I'd give him a space and carry on. I'm not quite out at the bush edge um, but there's a bit of a breeze so I just wanted the shoulder of the, the scrub a bit. So I've just thrown up a fly. That'll give me a um, Bit of shelter for any dew tonight. We'll crash here. I'll we'll, um, make a coffee and uh, look at jumping in the sack. It's clear up there at the moment. It could be quite a frosty night. Apparently, there's a couple of guys camped up at the head at the tarn, so expect to see some more people tomorrow. Alright, let's get a coffee on. Oh. A bit of a dew already starting to form on the inside. Just uh, made a coffee, made everything set up, so just going to climb into bed, enjoy this, and uh, set the alarm for the morning. See if we can beat the others out to the open. Young stag feeding his way back to the bush edge. It's uh, 580 away, which um, I got the ultra mag, but uh, it's only just gone six in the morning. So we'll make our way up to the top. It's um, calm, no wind. Quite uh, humid, a lot of fogging in the binos at the moment, it's a pain in the ass. But um, yeah, it should be a nice day. Alright, we'll carry on up.
Mm, couple of deer, 340 meters away. Just feeding. There's a young fella coming up the track behind me. I'm hoping he'll catch up because he didn't get to see any deer yesterday. And he may, if he hurries up, he may get a chance. I don't know where that young fella got, he might have turned around. But, um, yeah, one of those deer is just bedded down over there. 340 metres away. So, um, I'm not interested in shooting it. I'm just going to cruise on up to the top. Get round the camp this afternoon, set up, dry everything out. Beautiful, no wind. Couldn't ask for a better morning. And not much to see over this side at the moment. I did see a guy going down that far ridge a moment ago from the top. I um, haven't seen a camp, so I have no idea where they'd be. Well, I think I might actually camp at the tarn here. <coughs> haven't camped here for a while. So I'll get up on the top and wait for this uh, cloud to lift and see if I can spot a camp anywhere close. But if I can't see anything, I think that's the plan. Camp by the tarn, dry everything out. Have a cruisy day glassing once all this cloud disappears. Beautiful. Just spotted them over there. Try and locate his camp, see where he's camping. So I'm not in his way. He's a bit late for glassing. It's a uh, hubba state now. Exactly how it goes, it'll be a cracker. This is what I come up here to glass. I've been sitting up here for five or so hours with 50 metre visibility. I had the fly up, beard out, and uh, I decided to pack everything up and head lower and I can let you know it, by the time I got everything packed up, the cloud lifted. Bucket. I don't know what to do now. later we're back to the clag. I wish it would make his mind up. Oh, <clears throat> I've actually packed up the, the camp. I got about 10 minutes of looking at that uh, 
that slip on that side and it just clagged in again. So I'm going to head down lower, um, back down the track. If I can get an area where it's going to be stable and I can see, I may chuck the fly up and just camp out again tonight. Otherwise at this stage I might just pull the pin. I saw another deer on the slip just down there. Um, but another hind and not really interested in pushing through all that scrub to, to retrieve anything. So yeah, we'll just pack up and go for a walk. Well, I think that's a wrap for this uh, this trip. I've decided just to um, head home tonight. It's a bit breezy, but um, I come down off the tops where the clag was, and I've been sitting here glassing and watching another one across there. But um, yeah, I think I'll just head home. I'm not really interested in shooting anything, so stuff to do but uh, thanks for joining me on another one and uh, get out there and do it